guys welcome back to DIY life in today's video I'm going to be making a teepee cat bed for my cats I felt like it was time for them to deserve a new bed and I want to do something a little different than your regular cat bed the items I'm going to be using for this project are a couple of wooden dowels some type of fabric or cloth a little bit of wood stain jute twine and I will list in the description below on where I got each of my items the first thing I'm going to do is cut my wooden dowels I'm thinking I'm going to cut them about 15 inches each because that will give me just enough pieces of wooden dowel that I need to make the teepee bed so let's get to it <music> cut and I know that I said I was going to cut them at 15 inches but actually I went ahead and cut them at 21 inches that way they'll be just a little bit longer and my cats will have enough space to actually get in the bed so now that I have all my windows cut I'm going to go ahead and build my frame of the teepee. So now I am building the frame of the teepee and by doing so I am taking my pieces of wooden dowel and nailing them together in the shape of a triangle. <laughs> assembled and the next step I'm going to do is be staining my teepee. to add some jute twine around the corners and the top of the TP just to give it that TP effect. So the last step is to add the fabric part over the TP. I just picked up a couple of yards of fabric at Walmart and now I'm going to sew it onto the bottom of the TP and then I'll add some on the sides. I'm sewing by hand and it's been a couple of years so it's going to take me a little bit to finish this up. I just wanted to show you guys that you can sew it by hand around the TP base but I'm going to finish this off camera and then I will be back with the finished product. Alright guys so I finished sewing the fabric onto the TP and this is the outcome of my TP cat bed. All I have to do now is go show my cats and let them try it out. Thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to let me know how I did by giving me a thumbs up also don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the notification bell that way you're notified every time we drop a new video and as always thanks for watching and we'll see you guys next time for another diy